My name is Martin Matter with the Witness to War Foundation. It's January 23rd, 2019, and we're in Punta Gorda, Florida. Sitting with Mr. Bob Woolitz, W O O L I T Z. W O L L. Oh, thank you. Thank you kindly for the correction. W O L L I T Z. There you go. Who serves in the Korean War in the United States Air Force in the 19th Bomb Group, 28th Squadron. How are you doing today, Bob? How are you today? Well, if it wasn't for the weather change, I'd be better. Well, I haven't been outside yet, so we, that's news to me. acting up a little bit, but we'll, we'll manage. Well, i got to say it's nice to be here with you today. Thank you so much for joining me. My first question is, where are you from originally? Youngstown, Ohio. And tell me about your family. What was it like growing up out there? It was the family of the Depression. I was born just before it started, and then the rest of my family was a little bit later. But we, we managed through the 30s and then the into the 40s. My dad was a tool and die maker and uh, so we really didn't lose work. He never lost work during the depression so we muscled our way through not as bad as some people but it's you know it was a fairly at that time there wasn't much excitement so you just lived day to day. A bag of beans and a loaf of bread you were you were king. Now was there any military history in your family at all? Not not in my immediate family. I had an uncle in World War I. Uh, that was about it, really, in our, in, on my side. Now, on my mother's side, uh, there was another, another uncle that was in World War I. He, was, he served in France as a truck driver hauling ammunition up to the front. But uh, I, you know, we, we were always uh, waiting for Memorial Day and the, and the Memorial Day parades when the Legion would parade. It was always a big thing. And but was joining the service something you thought about doing growing up, or did you have other ambitions? Not necessarily, no. Uh, I always liked airplanes for some reason. It was, you know, I, just, I just built models and when I wasn't in school. Did you have an aviation experience early on that kind of shaped who? Who you were? How was that again? Did you have an aviation experience? Did, did you take a ride in a plane? Did you fly a plane ever growing up? Not until after the after World War II. 